And that's why they banned me from going to public swimming pools. That story was great and all, Joe, but where the hell is Obama? Shouldn't he be back by now from his business trip? Oh, yeah. And Donald's ass is still in jail. As far as I know, Obama doesn't really leave this house. Hey, guys. Hey, it's Obama's wife. Hi, Mrs. Obama. Are you having a good day today? Not really. Barack still isn't back from his vacation. He didn't even tell me where he was going. Vacation? He said he was going on a business trip. Man can't keep his story straight. I'm getting really worried. Can you guys help me out? We need to find out what my husband is doing. He said he would only be gone for a couple days, but it's been a whole week. Don't worry, Mrs. Obama. Let's go search his room and find something that will help us. Obama has some real bangers in his manga collection. There's so many fucking drones in here. Mm, nothing. I have not found anything either. Yeah, nothing from me. Let's keep searching. There's got to be something. I found something. What, what is, is it? it? Mm, wait, it's just some weird card. Huh, it looks cringe. Wait, let me see it. It is a 12 cost 12 12 enchantment that says, Free Donald, go to the place where wizards gather and you shall find the truth. Really? That's all it says? I knew we should have checked the kitchen instead. No, Joe. This is Barack telling us what we need to do. Okay, we first need to go meet with Donald and then... Bust him out of there. That sounds incredibly illegal. It's an emergency. I bet Joe can just explain to the police that we need Trump for this. It seems like Obama is in trouble. As much as I would like to go, I feel like I would just get in the way. So take this with you and save my husband. It's a deck box? Do you play magic? I used to, but I beat my husband so bad that I had to stop playing so I wouldn't hurt him anymore. What are we waiting for, Ben? Let's commit a felony. So the plan is, I use my facts and logic to convince the security guard to free Trump, and you stay quiet so you don't mess anything up. But I brought C4 just for this occasion. You fucking have? Never mind, just follow my lead. There you assholes are. How long were you going to keep me waiting? Donald, where's the security guard? Never mind that. Why is your cell so fucking nice? I don't know if you paid my bond or not, but I'm not leaving. This place is kind of awesome. Wow, look at this little bitch. The fuck did you say, you shithead? I sure bet you like walls now. Fuck you, Sleepy Joe. Guys, guys, that's enough. Barack is in trouble and we really need to help him. Only on one condition. What, what is, is it? it? Both of you say that I am the greatest MTG player that has ever existed. Ben, Obama is cool and all, but I don't know if this is worth it. Donald. Anything else? My whole character is based around elitism. You can't make me do this. Oh, yes, I can. You fuckers played a game without me. The least you could do is this. Fuck it. Fine. This is for Obama's safety. I don't like it, but I guess we have to fill Trump's ego. Just like how we filled up his mom from last night. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, Joe, that wasn't funny. Fuck you. You are the you greatest, are the MTG, greatest player MTG player to, walk to the earth. ever walk the earth. That was out of sync as fuck, but it's still music to my ears. Oh, by the way, the security guard is going to be a real pain in the ass. Now, just what are you boys doing? Fuck! Holy shit, is that Chuck Norris? The hell is a Chuck Norris? I see you boys are trying to break your friend out of here. Please leave both of you or else I will have to use force. Wait, we really need Donald to... Uh, fuck! I just realized my facts and logic have no facts. I can't prove that Obama's been kidnapped. We need old bitch boy fuck over off, here to help Joe. save our friend. Well, how about this? You three will fight your way out. Well, Obama's screwed. Shit! I only did one year of Taekwondo as a kid. Don't worry, guys, I got this. In a game of magic. You're fucked. You will never beat me. Perfect. I brought my magic decks just in case. Huh, weird. I brought mine as well. What are we waiting for? Let's pull up a table and get started. Are we ready, boys? We are not boys. We are, uh, political figures. He has a point. Guys, I wouldn't fuck with Chuck. There are some crazy stories about him. Now, now, Donald. There is no need to- Fuck you, Donald. You're just trying to get his favor. Like I said, bitch boy. Fuck you guys. You two aren't the ones that are still stuck in this cell. Chuck, what are those big cards on the table? No way. Are we playing arch enemy? We are playing arch enemy. I thought if you three team up against me, you would have a better chance at beating me. Team up with Sleepy Joe. Yeah, fucking right. I can't team up with someone who is that orange. Guys, let's all put our differences aside. Obama isn't here to keep us from fighting. So statistically speaking, we need to take responsibility and work together to save him. Let's extort Obama for money after all of this is over. I like the head on this fella. Welp, I'm glad you all got that sorted out since we are playing arch enemy. I will go first. Yep, that's what the rules are. I will draw for turn, play an island, and tap one to play a soul ring. Fucking cheater. He's just awesome. 
Ben's right. He's just scared to lose. Did you say something, guys? No, Dad. What in the fuck? I will tap two to play Talisman of Progress, and then tap it for blue, which will deal one damage to me to play Brainstorm. I will draw three cards and put two cards from my hand on the top of my deck. I will end my turn. Okay, guys, since we all go at once, let's take turns describing what each of us have done on our turn. Let's start with Joe. I will draw for turn, play a forest, and I am done. I will draw for turn, play a cavern of souls. I will name slivers and finish my turn. I'll draw for turn, play a forest, and pass turn. I will draw for turn, and now reveal the top card of my scheme deck. Oh shit, here we go. This man's gonna pulverize us. What the hell are scheme cards? Scheme cards are only used in Arch Enemy. And once during the opponent's pre-combat main phase, they reveal the top card of their scheme deck and set that scheme in motion. Those cards have effects that benefit the Arch Enemy whilst increasing our probability of losing. Did you get that, Joe? Only three of it. This card is a display of my dark power. Until my next turn, whenever a player taps a land for mana, that player adds one mana to their mana pool of any type that land produced. Wow, Chuck is so good at this game, he is giving us an advantage to make it more interesting. Donald's orange nose is now brown. That's fucking gross, Ben. I will play a planes and tap three to play Frantic Search. I get to draw two cards and then discard two cards. I also get to untap up to three lands. I will then tap three to summon my commander. Wow, Chun-Li, trash commander. L take, it perfectly suits him. Oh, Lord almighty, where do I get one of those cards with shoddy on the front? But Joe, Joe, what the hell? now it's is sold not out the time. Currently. Chun-Li has multi-kicker. When this card hits the field, exile up to X target instant cards from my graveyard, where X is the number of times Chun-Li was kicked. And then I put a kick counter on each of them. When this card attacks, copy each exile card you own with a kick counter on it. I then have the option to cast the copies. I will exile three cards in my graveyard, tap one to play Esper Sentinel, and pass turn. All right, guys, we are up. I will draw for turn, play a swamp, and tap three to play Kodama's Reach. Are you going to pay the Esper Sentinel cost? Yes. I can search my library for two basic lands, put one on the field tapped and the other in my hand. I will go get two swamps and pass it to Ben. I will draw for turn, play Breeding Pool, and pay two life so it comes Try in hard. untapped. Donald, whose team are you on? The one who's going to win. Ben, he has a change of heart. He's on our side now. Joe's ignorance might make this show a lot shorter than expected. Don't worry, Ben. I understand I'm a pretty humble guy. Preach, brother. Anyway, I will tap two to play Mana Weft Sliver. This gives all of my slivers the ability to tap for mana. I will then tap two to play Dark Heart Sliver. All of my slivers can now be sacrificed, and I can gain three life. I pass turn. I'll draw for turn, play a mountain, and tap two to play Inquisitor's Flail. It is an equipment, and if equipped creature deals combat damage, it deals double that damage instead. If another creature would deal combat damage to equipped creature, it deals double that damage to equipped creature instead. I'm also not paying the Esper Sentinel cost. I'll also play Strionic Resonator. I can pay two and tap this artifact to copy target triggered ability I control, and I can choose new targets for its copy. I'll pass turn. I will draw for turn and reveal the top card of my scheme card deck. It is, your fate is thrice sealed. When I set the scheme into motion, reveal the top three cards of my library. Put all land cards revealed this way onto the battlefield and the rest into my hand. Holy shit, that's really good. I don't know, Ben. I think it's really his commander that is um, pulling through here. Mommy Lee. It's Chun Lee Joe. Chun Lee. Right, right. I will get a planes and tap four to play Sentinel Tower. Whenever I cast an instant or sorcery spell during my turn, this card deals one damage equal to one plus the number of instant and sorcery spells casted before that spell this turn. I will then go to combat. Oh, come on, Chuck. There's no reason to attack us. Well, what I usually say here is I don't initiate violence. I retaliate. Excuse me? Logically speaking, you are initiating violence. Shut the fuck up, Ben. You're being annoying. What? How am I? What? I am going to swing my commander at you, Joe. I would take that all fucking day. Jesus Christ, this man is down horrendous. I think I agree with you for once. You will go down three life and get three commander damage. I will now cast Frantic Search, Brainstorm, and Soul Partition. I will exile Donald's Flail and Sentinel Tower will trigger. I choose one damage to Joe, two damage to Ben, and three damage to Donald. I will pass turn. Guys, this is bad. He can do a ton of damage with his board state. I just noticed that Chun-Li has multi-kicker and her whole thing is she kicks multiple times. 
Oh, I wow, didn't know that. that. How funny. That Good eye, funny. Donald. I bet that's not the only thing she... Joe, we are not doing that joke. That is very vulgar. I mean, sh she is kind of bad, though. Ben, I think we are surrounded. That's funny coming from you, Mr. Hush Money. Fuck Obama, this shit's too much work. Yeah, yeah, you're just mad Ben actually made a good joke. I will draw for turn, play a swamp, and tap three to summon my commander. You all know about this little guy, but if you haven't, it has forest walk, and I can make double the amount of tokens. But instead of those being copies, they are just 1-1 one -one squirrels. He also has an ability where I can pay one swamp and sack creatures and give a target creature plus X minus X until end of turn. I will pass turn. I will draw for turn, play a swamp, and tap three to summon Blur Sliver. This gives all of my slivers haste. I will pass turn. I will draw for turn and God damn it, I will play a mountain and pass turn. Don't worry, Donald, you will pop off soon. Oh, thanks, Joe, that means a lot. The fuck is that deck worth anyway, $200? Fuck off, Joe. This is the only deck they had for me in these prison cells. They have MTG decks in prison? I will draw for turn and do that six scheme deck reveal. I will use drench the soil in their blood. After this main phase, there is an additional combat phase followed by an additional main phase. Creatures I control gain vigilance until end of turn. I will play a command tower and then, what the hell is that noise? Yeah, what is that? Joe, what the fuck are you doing? I was trying to play snake on this and accidentally put in the code and now it's starting to beep. What started to beep? Joe, you need fuck. to turn that thing off right now. I am trying. That is at least going up in flames. What the hell is wrong with you two? Now let's see, it should be this. Thank God, Joe. Give me that. Okay, sorry, Benny. Uh, anyway, I will tap four to play Grand Arbiter Augustine four. White spells cost one less to cast, blue spells cost one less to cast, and spells my opponents cast cost one more to cast. I will go to combat and attack Donald with my commander. I don't know why you are attacking me. Those two tried to blow us up. That implies there's a chance I could have gotten hurt. Good point. I will take three damage. My commander will trigger and I will cast Frantic Search, Brainstorm, and Soul Partition again. With Soul Partition, I will target Ben's Darkheart Sliver this time. Damn! Sentinel Tower will trigger, and I will deal one damage to Donald, two damage to Joe, and three damage to Ben. I will tap one to play Blind Obedience. Artifacts and creatures my opponents control enter and tapped, and I will go to my next combat phase and attack Donald again with my commander. Same thing as last time, buddy. I will only be able to cast Brainstorm. Sentinel Tower will trigger again, and I will deal four damage to Ben. I will pass turn. I will draw for turn, play a swamp, and tap four to play Parallel Lives. If an effect would put one or more tokens on the battlefield, it puts twice as many instead. I will pass it over to Ben. Damn, Joe, that's a pretty good enchantment. I only hope to see my cute little troopers conquering the board soon. I will draw for turn, play Unclaimed Territory, and choose Slivers. I will then tap five to summon my commander. It is a 7-7 and I can pay two and put a sliver into play. It is a 1-1 one, one colorless token. I will pass it to Donald. I will draw for turn, play a forest, and pass. Jesus, Donald, fucking do something. I would love to, but someone didn't even bring my decks. You refused to play what I offered you. That's because your decks are garbage. It's okay, Ben. Donald was going to the psychiatric ward anyway. Fuck off, Sleepy Joe. I will draw for turn and reveal the scheme card. Your puny minds cannot fathom. This allows me to draw four cards, and I have no maximum hand size until my next turn. I will play a Plains and tap three to play Ursa, Lord Protector. Artifact, instant, and sorcery spells cost one less to cast. I can pay seven. If I control Urza, might stone and weak stone, exile them. Then I meld them into Urza Planeswalker. I can activate only as a sorcery. I will go to combat and attack Donald with my commander. Still a true American. My three spells will cast and I will exile parallel lives. Shit. I will tap two to play Faithful Mending. I gain two life and draw two cards, then discard two cards. I will then tap one to play Thought Scour. Target player puts the top two cards of their library into their graveyard. Then I draw a card. I target myself. I will also tap one to play Leap, and I will give my commander flying and draw a card. I will then tap one to play Brain Freeze. Target player puts top three cards from their library to their graveyard, and it also has Storm, where I can copy it for each time I casted a spell before this one this turn. I can choose new targets for its copy. I am very lost. Yeah, how many fucking spells has this man played? In short, he's going to do a ton of damage. I also feel like he might have forgotten some of his mana discounts, but it's no big deal. I will target all three of you for its Storm copies. Sentinel Tower will trigger, and I will give damage out to you guys. 
Bring it. Please don't. Anything, my lord. One damage to Donald, two to Ben, three to Joe, four to Joe, five to Donald, seven to Joe. I will pass turn. I get the feeling you don't like me. Actually, I greatly respect you as an opponent, Joe. Well, damn, this guy's kind of cool. Is there anyone here that wants to even rescue Obama? I will draw for turn, play a cabal coffers, and tap two to tap that land to float four black mana. I will tap three to play croissant grip and target Chuck's blind obedience. I will then tap three to summon Ruthless Knave. I can pay three to sack a creature and create two treasure tokens. I will also tap two to play Verdant Command and create four tapped green troopers. I also get four more thanks to my commander. Oh shit, I think I have an infinite combo. What? No fucking way. Wow, Joe. Way to go. I will use Ruthless Knave's ability to sack a squirrel and get two treasure tokens. But since one or more tokens were created on my turn, I get to make that many squirrel tokens. I now have two treasure tokens and two squirrels. I will sack the treasure tokens and... Damn it, I don't have enough mana to make that work. Not to mention, I forgot that spells are more expensive because of Chuck's Augustine. Wait, Joe, let me do something real quick. Go for it. Let's say instead I do my stuff first before Joe and Trump play their spells. That's perfectly fine with me. I will draw for turn and tap one to play swords to plowshare and target Chuck's Augustine. I will then tap three to play Hearthstone. The cost of each creature's ability now costs one less colorless to activate. Now give it a shot, Joe. I have what I need. I can now sacrifice one squirrel to get two treasure tokens and two squirrels. If I keep on repeating this, I get infinite squirrels. I also have an infinite combo. I wish I could do something cool. My slivers have haste, and they can tap for one mana. I will pay one mana to create a 1-1 one, one sliver, tap it for mana, and repeat this cycle infinitely. Let's fucking go. Fuck yeah, I will draw for turn, play a mountain, and tap three to play mana flare. Whenever a player taps a land, it produces one additional mana of the same type. I will end my turn. Well, guys, this sure isn't looking good for me. Two of you have infinite creatures, while one is there for emotional support. Fuck you guys for not bringing Tivit. I will draw for turn. Reveal the scheme card. It is evil comes to fruition. Put 701 green plant tokens onto the battlefield. If I control 10 or more lands, they are instead 3-3 three, three elementals. I'll tap 2 to play Fabricate and get Aetherflux Reservoir. I will then tap three to play that card. Whenever I cast a spell, I gain one life for each spell I have cast this turn. I can also pay 50 life to deal 50 damage to any target. Shit, guys. This might be bad. This is going to be awesome. I think it's almost time for a nap. I will tap three to play fact or fiction, take the top five cards of my library, give them to an opponent, and that opponent separates them into two piles. I put one pile in my hand and the other in my graveyard. Here you go, Donald. Hold on, Donald. Let me see. No, Ben, I got this. Here you go. Donald is so out of character right now. He probably has a celebrity crush on Chuck. I will then tap one to play rapid hybridization and target Ben's commander. He gets a 3-3 frog lizard token. I will play flawless maneuver and my creatures gain indestructible. I will also play submerge and target Joe's commander. I'll pay one to play snap and return ruthless knave to your hand, Joe. Play consider and shadow rift targeting my commander. Holy fucking shit, that was so many spells. This is bad. Aetherflux's trigger is going to be huge. Aetherflux triggers, and I will gain 35 life. Jesus Christ. Fuck. Sentinel Tower will trigger. I will focus all the damage on Joe, which will kill him, and I will pay 50 life to do 50 damage to Ben, and then another 50 life to... Oh, hold on, fellas. I need to answer this. Hello? Yep. Yep. Yeah. I'm on guard duty. Uh, wait, Bruce Lee, he's back. Shit, hang on. Sorry, guys, but I need to go, so see you later. Oh, shit, holy fuck, what was that? Well, the stories about Chuck are true. Did we win? Uh, you better believe I did. He was so scared to get mauled by my squirrels, he ran away. Shit, well, now what? The guard is gone. So how the hell will we unlock this cell? Well, we still have C4. I guess we logically have no choice. Maybe they won't hear it. Well, Donald, why don't you stand in that corner, away from the bars? Gotcha. I would like to not be exploded. Are we ready, guys? Yeah. All right. Three, two. It looks like the Trumpster is back, sadly. Fuck you, Joe. What are we waiting for? Let's go find Obama. Great job today, guys. Let's go solve this. How soon will it be ready, George? Soon, Barack. We need more time. It's currently really weak right now. 
if we push it, we could cause a major catastrophe. Uh, issue America. Ah, uh, I see. I guess I will wait. I hope the guys are doing all right. What are you going to do if they come looking for you? Well, we might just need for them to do the dirty work for us. Otherwise, things could get a little magical.